more specifically, he was standing here. Show the okay. Show the court where okay. Ooh, so it'd just be the spot where the killer is, right? Yeah. Yeah. Take that. This is where he was. Look, when the victim ran to the door, he was watching from this point. To him, he would be. She ran to the left. Please, this is no time for jokes and ill taste. That is where the killer was standing. <laughs> we like talking. Order! I will have order! Anyone disturbing the order of this courtroom will be held in contempt. Miserite! What are you suggesting? Rapscallion! <laughs> His face is weird when he's all nervous. <laughs> The, pros the postulations of the defense are a distortion of the truth, Your Honor. Indeed. Did you seem a bit far-fetched? <laughs> I should put a little far-fetched to Pokemon there. <laughs> oh ho ho! You provide for so much entertainment, Mr. Lawyer. What now? He's laughing? The hilarity of the moment made me remember something. It appears I have been unclear, and for this I apologize. Mr. Your Honor, <laughs> might I be allowed to testify once more? Very well. Let's hear your revised testimony. Good luck! You can't fix a broken testimony, buddy! <laughs> okay, let's see what he's got now. She ran to the left. I'm not going to do that every time. I guess it's kind of annoying. <laughs> Miss May's testimony was right, was correct, as was mine. When you assaulted the girl, she first ran to the left. And then you hit her, savagely. That is what I saw. <gasps> Next, with the last of her strength, she ran to the right. You chased her and delivered the final blow. That is what Miss May saw. You see? You hit her twice. Don't you remember, Mr. Lawyer? Hmm. That does seem to make sense. Will you be cross-examining the witness' testimony? You bet I will! I mean, yes, Your Honor. <laughs> Wait, so now he's claiming that, that Phoenix hit her twice. Mm -hmm. That has to be... That's how you come... Let's look at the autopsy. It says A blow. It would say multiple blows, wouldn't it? If it was multiple. So I think that's gotta be it. Because this is like a real- This isn't a really obvious one. Even the judge like, Oh, okay, that makes sense. <laughs> Even though we clearly figured this out. Okay. So I'm gonna assume that's it. Because that sounds right. Because usually if, if, if you got hit twice, it would say like, Hey, was hit and then died of another blow or something like that. So that sounds right, right? No. Uh, objection! Okay, the music stops, so we're good. Mr. White! The victim died of a single blow. <laughs> what do you have to say to that? Erp. Uh, 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 Now's my chance to hit him where it counts. In the testicles. <laughs> Mr. White, wasn't it you who told the court you were absolutely perfect? Uh, um, I will refrain from using that phrase from now on. Good, it's annoying. <laughs> I like that. Your Honor, <laughs> if you could ask the witness for a new testimony. The witness is obviously confused, Your Honor. I would like to request a 10 minute break. Yes, yes, quite. Objection! The witness is confused because he's lying! I ep epithetically? Yeah. Emphatically. Emphatically request that there will be no break, Your Honor! Okay. Yeah, um, we want justice! Don't let him get away! Very well. If the witness would care to revise his testimony. The court's on my side. No slip on this one now, White. Mr. White? Uh-oh, uh, okay. 
The two accounts. Uh, uh, well, see, look, uh, I, I looked at the other uh, window. I looked at the other window when I heard the thing, that thing fall. That, then, the next moment, I saw Miss Mia run to the left. The killer, you, attacked her, but she dodged. Um, and then, she turned and, and ran to the door. And then you hit her with a single blow. Let's slap! What other window? <laughs> I think he means the window. Hmm. Thwap indeed. <laughs> Very well. You may begin the cross examination. M Mr. Your Honor, my stomach, you see, it is hurting. Deal with it! Oh, freaking Phoenix Wright's epic. Deal with it. This is almost over. Uh, uh. You could have antacids in prison. Okay, two accounts. Oh, uh, you see, I looked the other window and I heard that thing fall. That thing? You heard that thing fall? What exactly was that thing? I don't think I can do that mic anymore. Huh? Oh, uh, oh, that, um, yeah, that. the glass light stand. Right. The one that fell over at the scene. Phoenix, doesn't something about, uh, that strike you as off? Nope. No. Yeah, very off. <laughs> <laughs> nope, that sounds right to me. Yeah, this is odd. I'll press further. Mr. White. Huh? What? You're saying that you saw the glass light stand? Y yes. Then change your testimony to reflect that. Uh, so sorry, my bad. The witness will revise the testimony. Uh, okay, okay, of, of, of course. I'm giving like Sully Christopher Walken. Yeah. <laughs> oh, the glass light stand was standing on the floor. They emphasize this light stand. Let's look at light stand yeah. real quick. Glass shards. Uh -huh. Glass, okay, the broken remains of a glass light stand. Broken beyond all recognition. So, how could he recognize it? Wait, hold on. Let me look at the floor plans. Wait, look! Look at, that's the, that's a point of view from the window. The it's glass light stand is left. there. Because it's fallen over. So if you looked from the window, you would only see broken pieces. Oh, you, yeah. You wouldn't so I think know it's, you wouldn't know it's a light stand. Because if it's standing up perfectly fixed, it would, it would be out of been, the window's view. Yeah. So I think that... Are we supposed to print the four pounds or the shard? I guess it's shards, right? So, um... Objection! See, this guy's easy to break now. Yeah. He's, like, doing really obvious crap. Miss... Oh. Mr. White? It was impossible for you to have seen that light stand. What? Uh. <laughs> That's a noise I make when he does a face. The stand broke into pieces when it fell. Oof! <laughs> Just by seeing the broken pieces, there would be no idea it was a light stand. So tell me, exactly when was it you saw the stand? Answer the question! <laughs> uh, isn't it obvious I saw the stand before it fell over? So, you saw a stand before the victim attacked then? Uh, c c correct. That would be no problemo, right? Hmm. Big problemo. <laughs> <laughs> There's a big problemo. Uh, uh, a mean problem here. What problem is this? Mr. White, let me make sure I have this straight. You saw the glass light stand through the window from the hotel before the incident occurred? Uh, correct! No, that is so. It's conclusive. Definitive. Undeniable. And, and, and impeachable. Impeachable? <laughs> no, it is impossible. You couldn't have seen the stand. No, 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 no way. No way, Jose. What? Why couldn't you? You have proof? I sure do, Your Honor. <laughs> a, a, person, a person in the hotel room could not see and fell over. So the floor plan is now, right? Mm -hmm. Take that! Look at this! Th these are the floor plans of the, the murder, yes? Correct, Your Honor! Now, look! If you were to look through the window at the office, this is the area you'd be able to see. Here. <laughs> Here. Well, note that the stand is not within the visible area. Well, Mr. White, what do you have to say to that? Er, herb. 
Uh, Ridiculosity, Mr. White. If you were here in the gay water, if you were in the gay water hotel as you claim, you could not have seen the stand before it fell over. In fact, you wouldn't have been able to see it after it fell either. There's no way you could have recognized this broken shard as a light as a glass light stand. So, when you see the stand, Mr. White, it must have been the moment that it fell. And the only place you could have seen that from is from inside the fatal offices. In other words, you were at the scene of the crime when the murder took place! Yeah, a little bit weird. <laughs> he said. Did we win? Yay. Mr. White? <laughs> Mr. White? <laughs> if Phoenix didn't do it, then who did, Mr. White? <laughs> said the judge. <laughs> You did it, didn't you? <laughs> Mr. Your Honor? I, I, Miss Mia. Heh, looks like we're about to get our verdict.